Before taking a photo, you must set up your picture quality at the highest resolution that your device offers. Look at the choices your device shows. High pixels represent a high quality picture. And what about video? It is a little bit different from taking a picture. It is recommended to set at 1080p or at least 720p for good quality. Think about light before taking the photo. Enough lighting can help you to prevent a dark and blurred image. If the area is too dark, try to change your position to take the photo. Try to find the best position to take a picture, the best quality settings possible with your device. Avoid shooting video facing toward the light and do not use the flash. The choice for vertical or horizontal frame depends on the situation and subject. Some pictures are good in vertical while others work better in horizontal format. The rule of thirds can help you to arrange the composition. In your mind, divide the screen into three sections, both vertically and horizontally, or turn on the grid function on your phone to help guide you. A good object position should be at the cross intersection where the grid meets. You may place a main object on one or two points where the grid meets, which can be on the right or left side of the frame. When using a mobile device, here are some tips. Do not zoom. Go closer to the plant or the leaves that you want to capture. This is because the zoom function reduces quality. Also, if your hand is not steady when zoomed in, the picture will probably be blurred. There are three levels of perspective. The first one is your normal view. The second is the worm's eye view, when looking up at something from below. The third is the bird's eye view, looking from above down onto the subject. Each of these three perspectives can give your picture a different emotion or feeling. Practice in the field and let us know if these tips work.